What's up guys, Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're unboxing the Geek Fuel for this month. And as you can see we have a special little uh, message here. It says, um, to our number one geek. That means I'm number one. And it says from the Geek Fuel team. So I, of course with Geek Fuel they don't have really like themes or anything. But maybe it'll be something Christmas related since there's a Christmas sticker on the front. I don't know, but this box is bigger than normal, and it's a lot of heavier. So there's something with weight in here, probably a book or something, but we'll just have to see. A bunch of coal. Okay, so first up, so I'll just kind of show we have our book first, and there's got um, the new, or I guess it's not new, it's got an AT-AT walker, but it's set for the new um, Rogue One, so it should be the AC or AT-ACT thing. Then there's a Death Star, like, blueprint on the back. Well, of course, we'll get into the book. Um, in a minute, so we'll start with the shirt first, and so it has a robot on the front, which I believe is from uh, um, RoboCop. Yeah, the new RoboCop could be the old. It's the old know. one. Never seen RoboCop. Don't really care to. Um, but yeah, I don't know any more about that. But it says Urban um, Pacification Unit, um, Omni Consumer Products and stuff. So it's got the little two-legged robot. That kills people. Oh, I don't know if it does. P. But, so there is that shirt. Next up, we have a something from Harry Potter, and it says Wizard Wear. Um, I don't know what's probably socks. What my guess is going to be a shirt or a scarf could be. Oh, well, looks like really big socks or scarf. Let's see what it can be. It's a scarf. It looks like very plain scarf. But I guess, um, because you see a lot of the Harry Potter scarves, and um, they have, of course, like um, like the Gryffindor logo or Harry Potter or something on This one's just a plain scarf with, I guess, keeps them out of copyright and all that sort of thing. Um, but it does look like something they'd actually like have in Harry Potter because they wouldn't have their own licensed product, obviously. Um, but it's got the Gryffindor colors of, like, the maroon or whatever in yellow and stuff, so that's really cool. I'll put a scarf on. Be warm for the unboxing. Um, so next we have our pin for the month of the little robot, and it's an R2-D2, which is awesome. And it looks like there's a rare of G2-F5 that you could have got the red one and stuff, but R2-D2 is so much cool. I like how it's the old, like, Kenner packaging style, too. Yeah. They did this with the last one with the uh, Indiana Jones version and stuff. And I guess the G2-F2 is, um, like, geek fuel. So it'd probably be R2F5 or something like that for the black and white one, I don't know. Or black and red. Next up we have, looks like, gift wrap. That's what it says. It's an 8-bit gift wrap. Oh, sweet. They did that last year, oh. too. And it looks like someone cut it. I don't know. It looks like there's a cut ripped into it or something. I'll have to look. Oh, yes. There is. So we have like this different, oh, there's different designs on it too. So we have this giant sheet. Zelda! I'll get that. So yeah, this one looks like Zelda. It does have a cut in it. Though. As you can see like right here, there's a hole cut in it. But someone like took a knife to the plastic wrapper, so there's a knife cut through that. Then we have this one, which looks like Mega Man. And then a Mario one in the red. So those are really cool. May have to use those on something. So that's just really cool. Never thought I'd get gift wrap in a box. So that is awesome. Next up, we have a club for caveman, like Frank. Um, but it is the steam code, and it's Caveman Craig and the tri or the tribes of Bog Bog Drop. I don't know, um, but it's still cool. Everything. So you can like beat somebody with it. Even though it's a piece of paper. You just gave the code away. No! Oh, well. Free code for anybody. I don't know if you can see it or not. But free code for anybody who wants it. So we do have a book in here. And it is The World According to Thor. So we got another book. Like we did in one of the other boxes. I'm not sure what is in here. Ooh, there's a little Mjolnir cutout thing you can make. That's cool. Um, it looks like it's just a lot of information and stuff about Thor. There's what look like stamps, but they're probably just stickers. There's like a poster looking thing. So it looks like just a breakdown of everything in the Thor world, so that's really cool. 
I thought it'd be a bunch of little like stories or something with Thor. But that's a really cool book. That is really cool. And it's worth $25. That's like the price of the box itself. <laughs> okay. Um, I was going to look through the book real quick because I always forget this isn't their spoilers. This is just their little book. And of course it's full of Rogue One related stuff. Um, so of course we have an advertiser for that um, Caveman Craig thing. A bunch of cool toys you can buy for the summer. Or Christmas. I don't know why I said summer. Then of course we have the pictures of unboxings which we're never in as always. But that's, they seem to so thumbs stuff. up that like button. Maybe we'll get in one of the photos one day. Yeah, it'd be cool if they put it if we were in. There are a couple people I recognize on there, so that's pretty cool. Um, but now we have our um, book thing. So it looks like for the shirt, if you're a man, or if you have ordered men, you get the dark blue, and in women, you get the light blue. So there's that. Then of course we have the scarf, which I'm wearing. Um, the wizard wear winter scarf, as it's called. The Caveman Craig code, code, steam code, the exclusive uh, Star Wars pen, which of course we got the awesome R2D2, the 8-bit gift wrap, and then for the books you could have got um, the World According to Iron Man or Thor, and we got the Thor one, so that's pretty cool because Iron Man's pretty boring, so <laughs> Thor is a lot better. So what was your favorite item out of this box, bro? Uh. I don't know. I I kind of like the shirt, but I also like the 8-bit gift wrap. Gift wrap, yeah. Yeah, I think the gift wrap's a cool idea. Um, even though it's the only bad thing, you get like a sheet and stuff, so it's you can only use as much as you know the sheet has or whatever. Um, but I really like the pin just because it's R2-D2 because he's one of my favorite characters out of Star Wars. And then I think this Thor book is really cool as well. Um, so that was a pretty decent box for this month, so be sure to hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed. Leave any comments you have down below. Hit the red subscribe button to um, catch up on all our videos, and we will see you next time.